We have a 2008 Chevy Impala. We're going through the steps in order to replace the fuel pump. We'll start by bleeding the pressure off the system using our pressure relief valve on our gauge. Be sure and capture the fuel into a safe container. Before doing any repair, disconnect the negative battery cable. In order to do a proper fuel pump replacement, we need to clean the inside of the tank and that will require the removal of the tank. At the rear of the tank, you'll disconnect the fuel filler hose. In order to gain access to this, you'll have to place your hand up through the cross member. Using a pry bar will ease the removal of the hose. At the left rear of the tank, disconnect the carbon canister vent line. Disconnect the fuel vapor hose. At the right rear of the tank, disconnect the electrical connection. At the front left corner of the tank, disconnect the emissions line and the fuel line. Be sure and capture any fuel into a safe container. Remove the four rivets holding the tank shield in place. Slightly pull on the center pin to release. With the fuel tank properly supported, remove the tank straps. Remove the tank from under the vehicle. It's a good idea to clean the outside of the tank before removing the module assembly. This will keep any excessive debris from getting in the tank. For these applications, there can be several different versions of the fuel pump. This does not affect in any way the installation of the module itself. Some of the most noticeable differences could be that the unit has three lines or two lines, or could have a pressure sensor or not a pressure sensor. Disconnect the electrical connections, making sure to remove the safety retainers. Disconnect the fuel line. When removing the carbon canister vent line, it can be easily damaged. It's best to remove it from the carbon canister and then from the module assembly. Disconnect the vent line. Remove the locking ring with a non-ferrous brass punch by turning it counterclockwise. You'll need to inspect the locking ring to make sure it's not damaged in any way that would hinder the reinstallation. When removing the old module from the tank, keep in mind there's a residual amount of fuel in the reservoir of the pump. Be sure and capture this into a safe container. At this point, we need to drain the remaining fuel into a safe container and then clean the inside of the tank. We want to be sure that the tank is as clean as possible to allow a clean environment for the fuel pump. Now that we've thoroughly cleaned the inside of the tank, we'll install the new AirTex module assembly. Install the tank seal into the proper location on the top of the tank. As we lower the module assembly into the tank, make sure that the locating tab is oriented properly so that the fuel lines are pointing towards the carbon canister. Install the locking ring, turning it clockwise using a non-ferrous brass punch, making sure that it is fully seated into the safety retainer. Reattach the fuel line, Reinstall the carbon canister vent line. Remove the old safety retainer off the vent line. Install the vent line into the module assembly. And reconnect the electrical connections. As you raise the tank into position, be sure and place the electrical connection, the vent line, and the emissions line over the top of the cross member before fully raising the tank into position. With the tank fully raised into position, reconnect the tank straps. At the rear of the tank, reconnect the electrical connection, the vent line, and the emissions line. And reconnect the fuel filler hose. At the front of the tank, reconnect the fuel line and the emissions line. Reinstall the tank shield into position. With the repair complete, reinstall the negative battery cable. Cycle the key three to four times in order to charge the system. 
Start the vehicle and monitor pressure, making sure it's within vehicle specifications. Now before we remove our pressure gauge, we'll shut the vehicle off and bleed the pressure using our pressure gauge, making sure to capture any fuel into a safe container. 